we're back out again today. It's a very cold day, that's why I've got my hat on to keep warm. And let me tell you, it's lovely and warm. Yeah. So we're out, uh, we're in lockdown and we're not out for exercise. Yep. So we're looking, looking around the local parks in our area, see if we can find. We've, been, we've had a few good finds here, around here before. And uh, we're going to have a look around, look around, because we've been to some really nice places and uh, yep. not been here for a while. So we're going to have a look around some of our local parks and see if we can find anything. And we are going to bring uh, you guys with us. Looks like somebody's had a sandwich and not bothered to take their rubbish away. That's nice. I think we'll take that with us when we go. Stick it in the bag. Right, I've not done a giveaway for absolutely ages. So what I'm going to do is I am going to um, make another sweatshirt like this one. I don't know if I'm going to use this this saying or one of my other ones. I don't know. But I'm going to make one um, and I'm going to give it away. And I'll give it away to someone in the live chat. Not this video, but the next one. So if you want to win it, you want to be in a chance of winning it, um, come along to the live chat next week on the premiere and we'll give you a number and we'll pick one of you out. I won't make it till we find out who's won it, just so that we get the size right. Okay, so don't forget, next week, join in the Premier Chat and you could win a sweatshirt. Right, well, we'll have a walk down this path, which is still here. Um, through through all the uh, undergrowth and see if anyone else has been and unearthed anything for us because that's what we want really ideally we want someone to come along do a little bit more digging for us take what they want and then just just leave us some stuff it's all overgrown here now this lot wasn't here this lot here wasn't here last time I was here well last time we was here Wonder if anybody's been here digging up. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't realize the camera was crooked. I'm holding it by the lens. So yeah, it, it does actually look like there's some fresh earth there. So yeah, I think someone might have been having a dig, which would be perfect for us. Yeah, that's just definitely a little bit of fresh earth there. I can't believe this was so overgrown in the summer. Absolutely. You couldn't get here. You couldn't get anywhere near it. See all the giant hogweed, that dangerous stuff. But yeah, no, look, someone's obviously tried to have a little bit of a dig. There's certainly a lot less here than there was, but yeah. Right, let's have a look. Let's have a look for some pottery. I'm going to keep my gloves on because it's a bit nippy. Oh, it's just white. No good, but some pottery over there, so. Yeah, someone's obviously had a bit of a dig here, Mick. Like it, yeah. yeah, so we'll see. We might, might have dug up something. Just because they don't want it doesn't mean we don't want it. Um, so yeah, might find some pottery here. So I'll bring you with me. It's a white. I have got my scraper in my bag in case... Uh, I want to give it a little bit of, bit of a scrape. Oh, there's a bottle. What's this bottle here? Oh, one of those square ones. Oh, what a shame. Little uh, little ecosystem going on inside there, though. That looks nice, doesn't it? You could put that on your windowsill. Keep watering it. <laughs> a little ecosystem in your house. Yeah, I like that. I won't take it. I haven't got any window windowsill space. But yeah, let's have another. Let's have a look. Broken jar, broken pots. Yeah, there's been a few, few holes dug here since the last time we were here. Right, we've got some shards here, so let's see if we've got anything with any colour that we can use. I have had shards here that have like gold on them. Bit of, bit of the uh, jam pot there. Let's have a look down here. Yeah, just jars, aren't they? Bits of old stoneware. Oops. That 
looks like it's of a, a chamber pot, something like that. Yeah, the, tell you what's hampering it, leaves. Leaves everywhere, it's making it very, very difficult to see, really. Um, but we'll, yeah, we'll keep trying. Might find something, it's definitely worth coming back to have a look, wasn't it? What's the bottom of that? So, oh, no, it's nothing. Nothing, thought it had words on it, just lines. Oh my, oh, what is that? What is that there? Now that, it's not full. Oh, it's not full, but you know what? That is absolutely, definitely coming home with me. That's a dough bowl. It's got sides. It hasn't got the it hasn't got full sides, but that is enough to be able to use. I'm getting my scraper on that. I'm emptying it out, and that is coming home with me. A dough bowl. I know it's broken, but it's a whole base. I'm having that. That is a great find. Yeah, I'm just going to get the soil out of here so I can carry it. That can go in my bag definitely. My friend said she'd been down here. Uh, Mandy said she'd come down here with her, with her fella, Trevor, for a bit of a dig and said there was nothing here. Um, but to them, this would be nothing. They would want the whole, the whole bottles, I think. So, Mandy, Trevor, if you came down here and dug this out, I can't believe you left it. <laughs> I don't, can't believe you didn't tell me about it. Otherwise, I'll let you off. Right, dug out. That is usable. It's a bowl shape and it's my favourite kind, so I'm having it. Yeah, we can still see lots of fragments of stuff. So what's this one? Is it a proper, proper base? Let's see. Put my glasses on, you know the score. Yeah, that's a real, genuine Hartley's base. What a shame. It's not a full one or even a few inches. It's uh, completely smashed on that side. But yeah, that's, that's a real one. Right, there's definitely someone's been here up this end as well. So we've got... Jam pots, broken, what's this, <laughs> plain, oh that one's got a bit of a pattern on, that one's too plain, I did leave one here last time that had a peacock on it, yeah a terrine lid had a peacock on it and for some reason, I don't know why, I left it, why did I leave it, it had a beautiful peacock, I think because I was too uh, focused on finding full bottles because I got a bit excited when I came here, um, but yeah, there's quite a few things dotted about, so let's have a look. Let's see if there's anything, any little gems for us. Yeah, and I'll take you with me because it's always better if we find it together, isn't it? Plain plates. Jam jars. Oh, that would have been a big one. That would have been a nice big one, wouldn't it? Oh, what a shame. It's always gutting. Always gutting when you find those big ones broken. Oh, look at that. Half a cup. Now, that might come in handy for something, that actually, because in my doll's house, I'm in the middle of making something out of half a teacup, half a egg cup. So, yeah, tea, half a teacup, you're coming home with me because I might make you into something um, exciting for my doll's house. It's got a beautiful pattern on it. Don't know if you can see. Oh, look, a bit like fish scales up there. Yeah, that's nice. Right, that's going in my bag. It's a big old bottle, that one. It's broken now. Yeah. Big old bottle, that one. You see they planted hogweed here. Look. This, These hogweeds wasn't here last time we was here. So they plant them in there, stop people from coming in here. But unfortunately, I don't think the people come in in the summertime. So hogweeds are pretty much dead now. So, uh, continue as we are. So it's like an old Lucasade bottle there. The design, especially to take to people in the hospital. We used to have like an orange paper wrap around it, if we recall right. Transparent paper. Right. Jam jar down here. Part of a jam jar. Bits of everything. Just remains. And 
free to that tree's way down, there's a big tree look at that, see it do station out let's get closer and have a look let's hit the building there I just missed that uh, telephone tree there, look you can see it bent some of the wires up there Whoa. just bent some of the wires here or the metal bits stop people climbing up sort of inside just fall down in the night as I think we are not camping here eh? a little bit of a jar and bottle graveyard going on here oh what's that is that something or nothing glasses thought it might be no it's a bit of a, bit of a twig <laughs> that's a definite nothing thought it might be a cork I'm collecting old corks to go in my bottles right what have we got here oh, what's that bottle there it's not getting any writing on it nope no writing on it, so it's not appealing to me. It's an old one, you can tell by the base. But yeah, that one's not quite appealing. What's that one there? Oh, it's a foot of tablespoons. Oh, it's got a bit of a, a dink. It's got a dink in the corner of that tablespoons. Probably where they dug it up and just shoved the spade through it or the fork. Oh, what's that? That won't be whole, will it? No, it's a half of one. Half of a, of a pot teasing us there. Yeah, a little bit of a graveyard here, whoever's been here has had a bit of a go. Lots of pottery. Yeah, more smashed ones. I hope they haven't smashed them trying to get them out. Oh, that would have been a little, little tiny teapot or something, I think, by the shape of that. Yeah, bottles. Another base of a big flagon look oh that would have been ginormous that would have been huge right there's some up there as well oh what's this now that looks full what's this teapot thing here oh, too much of too much of a dink out of that one right let's have a look at this pile here oh it's got a big chip out of it but no i don't need it the, the thing's too big on it the crack is way too big on that. Look at it, it's massive. That's all goes all the way around. That goes all, it's held together with the soil, I think that. Yeah, won't take that one. Oh, that's got some writing on, so let's let's read the one with the writing on. See what it was. Bolton. Direct family supply. Oh, there you go. Oh, what's that one? Has that got any dinks in it? Nope, no dinks in it. But it's a beautiful colour. It's got lots of bubbles in it and I'm going to clean that up for my friend. She's, she wants some old bottles. She just decorated her house really like old style. So, yep, I'm going to take that one and I'm going to clean it up and give it to my friend. That's a nice little find. I don't want to go further down there. I'm just going to go back up here and have a look at these round here. Should get my scraper out really. I might do in a minute. I don't think I need my scarf. Oh, I don't think I need my scarf. It's cold, but now I'm moving about. <laughs> I'm getting uh, a little bit sweaty. Right, okay, let's have a look over here. Let's see if we can find anything. I'll bring you with me. Obviously, what's that? Pots. Jars. Oops, sorry. Jars. Just let me stick the bag down. Sort of. No, nothing on that. Oh, hang on, what's that? Oh, glasses, sorry. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that, that. Right on the edge, they just missed it. They just dug and they just missed it. Well, your miss is my gain. Oh my God, that is a great little find. Look at that. Wonder what that was off. That's amazing. A glass stopper. That's a beautiful glass stopper. 
yeah that is definitely a keeper just shows you just just keep looking just keep looking because even though they've been they've missed it haven't they that was right on the edge if they'd done one spade more they'd have got that that is beautiful that is coming home with me definitely right let's carry on Bit of a cup was. Oh, there we go. There's one with some pattern on, and you would find some pottery here with some pattern on. That is a beautiful pattern. Pinks and greens. That's lovely. Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. <sighs> I was just beginning to think there was nothing here with any with any pattern on it. But yeah, that's beautiful. Gonna keep that one. Uh, while I'm doing while I'm filming, I'm scouring at the same time, looking along the edge, just in case. Just in case I miss. I think they've dug all this actually. This has all been dug. Feels quite uh, quite soft. Yeah, I might come back and get my scraper on it once I've had a, a bit of a, a mooch around. Right, I need to go carry on going this way now. Okay, so yeah, put that in my pocket. That's nice. Right, just at the other side of, of here now. Let's have a look. Pots, bottlenecks. Oh, half a lid. What a shame because I've started collecting full lids again now. A jar. I've got a million jars. A million jars. I have saved a few of them for my friend as well, for another friend. Um, but she has yet to collect them. Oh, what's that there? It's a lip of a jar, is it? Yep. What's this here? What's this tall thing? What is that? That. Whatever it, oh. Whatever it is, I can even mend it. Because that's that's actually the top edge glasses. I can even mend it or cut it down. I can't tell what it is. Has it got some sort of writing on it, or is that a label? Has it even got writing or a label on it? So thinking, thinking, thinking. Is it writing? It's probably a label on it as soon as I. As soon as the wipe it is gone. Well, anyway, that's the top edge. Yeah, I'm going to clean that up and I'm going to mend it with the clay like I do because it mends quite really well. These these sorts of things for you to be able to use it. So that little pot thing, and I might even have a lid that'll fit it because I've been saving the lids, haven't I? So yeah, that's a keeper, definitely. Right, that looks like it was some sort of teapot. Let's see how much of it is left. Oh no, it's not a tea. Oh, is it a jug? A jug with a handle and a spout. Am I going to mend it? Of course I'm going to mend it. Just needs a little spout and a handle. Who can't make that and make it something that we can use? Oh yeah, definitely. Me and me uh, craft projects are getting uh, quite big now. I've got quite a few things to make. So yeah, I'm going to put a spout on this. I'm going to put a handle on it. And I'll probably do something else with it as well. Um, but yeah, that one is a keeper. A little old jug right oh that that's a that's a whopper of a bottle that has it got any writing on it so I thought, is it milk bottles do you think hmm i don't know what a shame it's got no writing on but it's got a, a real a real big dink out but i don't know if you've seen it yet or not but i've mended a glass uh bottle um, an ink bottle where it had a big dink in it like that that would make a great vase i could easily mend that with the uh with the resin and do and do something on it what do you think right i'm going to leave it there i might take that because i can mend that dink in the neck and do something on the bottle and make it into something nice so yeah i might take that one with me i'll just have to try and empty it out first though because it's absolutely full of soil <sighs>
piece with a pattern on. Good, because I just thought, I was thinking there's only that one piece that we found. There we go. Oh, it's too, too curved, that one, I think. Yep, too curved, too damaged. But yeah, that's a nice little blue and white one. We'll have that. There you go, just kicked over another piece. A nice big one with a nice navy blue pattern on it. Yep, that's a nice piece of pottery. We can do something with that, especially because it's flat. Flat ones are so much easier to work with and to do things with. Yeah, I'll add that to my crafting list. Oh, there's somebody's spade. Oh, you know what? I left my trowel here. I bet that's gone. I left my trowel here last year. Um, it's probably gone, but there's a little spade there if you fancy digging. Uh, right, yep, I'm going to put that in my bag. Let's see if there's anything in this bit here. Try and get in without killing myself. Yeah, we'll have to come back when all these leaves have gone. These leaves are really hampering the view. Um, I could I could scrape all that bit over there, but with all these leaves about, it's probably not worth it. Sauce bottle, just plain. There's another sauce bottle. I don't like those shapes. I don't know why. Probably because I don't like tomato sauce. But uh, yeah, don't like those shaped bottles. The hexagon bottoms. Another sauce bottle. If they were blue, I'd take them, but they're clear, so I won't bother taking them. Oh, what's on this bottle? I think we left this bottle last time. What does it say? Oh, Manchester. No, we didn't. Manchester. Boddington's. Has it got a crack? It's got a bit of a crack up there. My bag is getting quite full now. But yeah, I'm going to get Mick, um, Mick. I'm going to get Mick to sort out that. Um tile cutter yeah we're gonna do i've got loads of cod bottles that need cutting down so yeah i'm gonna get mick to sort that out for us the other way now the, the leaves on the ground are really hampering the looking um but we can come back when the leaves have gone so it's a, a second look isn't it later on maybe in a couple of months but i just spotted this in the oh look oh viral viral one but it's broken but i like that yeah he said he's going to get his um he said he's getting his um cutter out when we get back so i'll just pop that one on the list for him to cut down because i like that i could grind that well i say i he can grind that off i can make some sort of lid for it that and that would make a great these shapes make great harry potter style bottles yeah that is a keeper i like it i like that shape i had one i think i've had one before and i did make it into a into a bottle into a harry potter style bottle so yeah that is easily ground off. I don't know how I missed this first time around, but that has got some writing on it. Let's have a look. Household. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know what that is, but it's got writing on it. Household. Ooh. I wonder what that could have been. It's like ridges all the way down from there, but then not there. Maybe some sort of polish or something like that. I'm going to take that. Try and figure out what it is. Do you know what it is? Household. Hmm. Maybe it has some sort of polish in it or something like that. I don't know. Polish, maybe. Oh, that's a nice little find. Just when I thought I can't see anything else because of all the leaves. That little thing poking on top. And I walked past it before. Probably if I look back at the video, I'll see it. But yeah, I'll turn that into something. I can gild I can sand the edges and gild it and still keep the the writing on it. Yeah, I'm keeping it. I focused on finding full bottles because we've got a little sand for the whole thing. But yeah, there's quite a few things dotted there. So a chunk of icy water in there. Look. If you look real carefully, you can see that old wall that used to be here. Going all the way up and across there. It used to be a farm or something and then the army used it for a short while and now nature has come and taken it right back again you'd never want to get this close to hogweed i'm sure so i'll do it for you I'm scraping the leaves away and that to me looks like the bottom of a doll's head and it is that's the neck bit of a doll's head isn't it that's the back 
sorry, that's the back. That's its little chin. Oh, what a shame, but yeah, just, I thought, oh, you know what, I'll just move some of these leaves now while I'm here. Look at that part of a doll's head, and you know I keep parts of doll's heads. So it's not a stretch for me to take that home, is it? Got a little chin. Oh, see, someone's dug that up and just discarded it, but the leaves have gone on it. So yeah, I'm just going to scrape away a few of these leaves and see what it what it uh, reveals. Brushing, brushing the leaves away from there has just revealed a lovely handle. Oh, look at that, that's a nice one. Like navy blue and white. Certainly not got one like that. That's in good condition. Um, I'm inspired by um, Sue, you know Sue, who we go on some of the mudlarks with. Let me turn it around. Sue, who... Um, we're on a mudlark Yorkshire, we've been a few times with Sue. Um, she makes frame, box frames with things in. And she puts the handles around the frame. So yeah, I might try and do something a little bit like that. Um, obviously not as good as Sue, because she's an expert at it. Um, but yeah, I think I might try something like that. Decorate a frame with it and whatever, we'll see. It's, it's inspiring me to think of something to do anyway. Uh, enjoy it at all? Uh, yeah, just by scraping the leaves off the top, um, I found part of a doll's head, which is always makes me happy. Um, an amber bottle, a little, a perfect little amber bottle. Right. Um, a few bits, bits and pieces, just take away the uh, the layer of the leaves off the floor. Yeah. So you're leaving here soon, I'm sure. Yeah. You, you know what? We've, we've got enough. We need to wait for these leaves to die, really. Yeah. Too I should just keep you on when I'm scraping because now I've just scraped up this. And I know I've got a million, but yeah, a little paste jar, perfect. Just having a scrape. Oh, goodness me, I can't scrape everything. Look at all the leaves here. Couldn't possibly scrape all them off. I'm still at this little patch here where I found that thing with the household writing on it. Just taking the leaves off everywhere. Yeah, that just dinked out. Paste jar, complete. It's not got any... I don't, I don't think it's shipping because it's not got the writing on, has it? But it would have had its plain bit there where it would have had the label on. But yeah, you know what, I'm going to take it because I dug it up here, local, on my doorstep. And, you know, I use them. I use them for work with the kids, put paint in them, what have you. And um, so, yeah, I'll put that in my bag and keep scraping. Another scrape. I'm going to bring you with me. Oh, I thought it was a screw top. I wasn't excited then. Now I'm excited. That is an amber bottle and it's not a screw top. Anything on the bottom? Oh, it has. It's got writing on the bottom. Oh, gosh. Let's see if we can try and make that out. Oh, upside down. That says, welcome. Welcome. R something works. R rem dot works. Welcome. Rem dot works. Welcome. Right, okay. Or hem. Hem. Hem works, but that I haven't got one of those. An amber bottle like that probably would have had a cork in. That is beautiful. Don't think you can see it, but it's an amber an amber bottle. That's a beautiful little find. Just through a scrape. Oh, I'm so glad I decided to take these leaves away. Yeah, I'm going to bring you with me just in case. I'm just going to put this in my bag. Sorry. Right, let's have a scrape together. Watch now, nothing will come out. I do like you to be with me, but Mick will uh, take off any film that's I'm scraping and there's uh, I don't reveal anything. So this feels like loose soil. This actually, so I think this has been dug because it's very easily scraped off. Oh, I could be here forever scraping. Right, I'll bring you back if I find something. I think it's probably the best way because there's so much ground to cover. Right, I don't know if that's something in there or not. I just saw it like glass. Oh, oh, it's just the uh, the kick up bottle kick up. There you go, little bottle kick up. Right, we're going to sign out here. Had a good day. Had a good day. Yeah, I found quite a few nice things. Yep. It's all right. We'd like, so we've not been here for a long while. We saw it in the video the other day. So we thought, let's come back and have a look, see yeah. what's going on here. Looks like somebody's been digging here, but. Uh, yep. We need it to die down a bit more before we... You need the leaves to die, really, don't we? And it's get quite cold as well. Yeah. Although the sun's shining, it's cold. That's why I've got my nice warm hat on. It's nice wearing it. It's lovely warm. It just reminds me of when I used to have hair 
Oh dear, he's getting upset because he's missing his hair. Please don't forget, if you really liked it, press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Poor Mick, he, he really wants his hair back. What can we do? I just have a bit of fun, you know, I'm <laughs> joking. My hair's fine. So don't forget to subscribe, give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, don't forget we've got the Kofi link down below where you can donate the price of a coffee. And we need it today because it's um, really it's cold. It's very cold. And, uh, <laughs> thank all the subscribers, thank all the yeah. new subscribers, and thank everybody. We appreciate you all. Give us a like and don't forget to get the comments going and uh, don't forget the competition. Oh, yeah, the competition, week. yes. You want to be in with half a shout? You've got to be in the. Uh, You've got to watch the premiere. You watch the premiere. If you watch everybody's premiere anyway, which yes. it helps what you do helps every youtuber so yeah. uh watch the premiere and if your lucky number comes up you might get a t-shirt but you can check i think we'll do sweatshirt sweatshirt t-shirt whatever go sweatshirt it, yeah. yeah and uh you can pick whatever you want like uh, that's it keep it whatever that's coming home with me or... yeah okay we're gonna say goodbye for now see you all soon bye-bye bye, -bye. bye.